And welcome back, folks, to yet another exciting episode of Clive Barker's Jericho. We are, supposedly, in the Temple of Pain, which belongs to Vicus Cassus. The twisted ruler of this garrison of undead Romans. Which kind of makes me wonder, by the way. Well, that works. Hold on, we're gonna have to wander a little bit after these guys are dead. Uh, I think that should suffice. Oh, there's another one. Oh, there's another two. Okay. Well, that works. Alright, that's better. So here's the thing. I understand that uh, Al-Khali... Will you die, please? Here, have some fire. This is what you've been waiting for. Indeed. Ah, that's one less guy to worry about. Okay, I guess we're... Um, Gonna have to keep wondering after all these guys are dead, actually. There we go. Not too bad, actually. Delgado is doing some good work. Yuck. That's good. Uh, yeah, so... Alkali is supposedly a very far out outpost, right, of the Roman Empire. Still, you'd expect them to, I don't know, check up on the place once they stop hearing from it entirely. I mean, I have to assume that once it got sucked into the uh, pixies, or the boxes they call it, um, that no more news would reach outside. So what did Rome do? Like, did they just say, screw this place and seal it off basically and forget about it I, I don't know I mean or maybe they even sent something of a of an investigative effort here but they all got killed and after that they decided never to investigate again I don't know to be fair Rome I suppose was pressured over the next couple hundred years from various sides and even split apart into a lot of history in these walls yeah, even split apart into uh, the eastern and, and western parts of the Roman Empire and all that. So maybe they just didn't have the resources anymore to care about uh, colonies and garrisons this far out, and they just centralized the... The architecture is impressive, but I didn't expect it to be this bloody. You didn't? Everything has been bloody that we've seen so far. In fact, I... I expect it to be more bloody. I mean, you can actually see some parts of the floor that are not covered in blood. And even the walls have some whiteness remaining. That's kind of bizarre. Well, this is more like it, I suppose. So yeah, maybe maybe the Romans just uh, said, forget about this place and decided not to bother anymore. Target's incoming, sir. No, they're not incoming, they're just standing there. So, instead, you are gonna be the one who's incoming, Cole. There you go. Anybody else? Yes, there's somebody. Oh, that's a bit too early. Actually, that wasn't half bad. You can actually see the uh, the symbols on the shield there. That's kind of cool. I'm not getting through there. Not with normal weaponry. Establishing temporal loop. Frag out. So let's just do that again. Grenade out. Actually, this will not allow us to. Yeah. Yeah, look at Cole. I mean, she's really effective at this, isn't she? Oh, 
right. That's a bizarre thing to say. Establishing temporal loop. I mean, obviously they actually want to hug us, don't they? Where'd he go? I think he went flying. Oh no, actually he's still there. Right, well, um... Unless I missed something, we're actually supposed to keep going this way, so... Yeah, blood everywhere, of course. I I really like how the blood is kind of in the lower parts of the room. You can kind of see that the creatures keep dragging the blood everywhere they walk, but obviously they have a harder time reaching up there to the to the higher parts of the walls and to the ceilings. Something's coming, sir. Whoa. Something very angry. And big. What in the hell? Oh. Ah. There we go. It's a puzzle boss, a mini boss actually. Now if you want to do this more quickly, you're going to go for black here. And there. Whoa, it sounds like a rhino. Or maybe like a cow, actually, I don't know. Ooh. I guess he didn't like that. It'll actually try to focus on whomever you're controlling at the time. So, well, we switch back to black. That's really widely open now, this gash. That's nice. Thank you, girl. I guess we can just go back to Gel Delgado now. It's not dead yet. I don't think this works. Ah. Uh, uh. Okay, died standing up like that. That's kind of weird. But I'm not. Oh, hello. Oh, didn't work. I wanted to turn around behind him, but. There wasn't enough room for that. Okay. That kind of worked. Right. I think I think we're gonna stick with Cole for now because she is kind of fun to blow people up with. I guess this is where we need to go because that's where the enemy came from. really have a lot of castration fetish in this game, don't they? I mean, the enemies are castrated, the statue is castrated, it's kind of messed up. Alright, here we are, hello. Got a couple of presents for you. They're all beepy and blinky and really nice. Ah, not a big deal. There you go. So yeah, this game... This game certainly breeds a certain, uh, a certain attitude that, you know, uh, losing a person, you know, dying once isn't really that big a deal. So you'll just uh, switch characters, at least assuming you have a couple to choose from. You are not really covering your bases there, soldier, dude. Whoa.
Yeah, just circle around, I suppose. That was intense. Really, it was just one guy, Jones. Cover. You you can calm down now. I guess he he's just so amazed that he actually killed something. He isn't the most useful guy, unfortunately. I I kind of like him as a historian and all that. But his special powers are kind of lackluster, at least in the gameplay sense, you know. That's okay. Target spotted. His gun is good. What's going on? Oh. Speaking of which... Yeah, this is one of those cases where Jones is actually relevant again. Not just an extra gun, but actually relevant. Because he's a, he's got another one of those puzzles, right? Praise the Lord and pass the ammunition. Now, where am I going? Yeah, there's a... There we go. There's a lever there. I don't know if you even saw that. Right, now I'm gonna need another one. And... I'm guessing there's another one over there, another lever. Maybe not, maybe that was all there is to it. Yeah, yeah, calm down. There you go. Let's go with black, I suppose. I I'm gonna try and take out these creatures, maybe that's all that we needed here. Unless new ones are spawning in after this. En route. That didn't work. Too long range, actually. Well, that did some damage, but it didn't kill him. Where is he? <laughs> kind of blind here. Jesus, Mary and Joseph. Well, that's better than nothing. I guess that was all that we needed to do uh, with Jonesy here. Yeah? We can't even jump down there. I kind of wanted to try that. So Jones has uh, closed off the access point, but now we actually need something else. And I remember being kind of stuck here for a little while because I just didn't realize that that was what I was supposed to do um actually yeah so this is another puzzle right but before we do that Billy can actually so church can basically make, make it over there because she's so I don't know artistic I suppose I mean she, she also was the one who did that crawling and jumping in the uh, Templar fortress right but before we do that, I think we're gonna send. Advance to waypoint, Alpha. Yeah, you're supposed to stand on that. I'll go with you, Billy. The path Jones, do you have an issue? Advance to waypoint, Alpha. There you go. Delgado knows what's up. Yeah. So uh, these are buttons that you can push. Both need to be pushed at the same time. For something to happen, I don't quite remember what. Anyway, the the, the point is this: uh, you have to. Omega. Take point. Yeah, make use of this Moving function to solve this puzzle. I think you can actually do that from over there too, but I guess we can get it done now. So, thank you, Black. Now we're gonna try our hand on this awful thing. You know what's coming, right? Yeah, you know. This. This. Oh, this looks crackly. Be careful, church. Very crackly. Okay. Oh, whoa! Whoa, whoa. Okay, she made it. Lucky you, actually. That would not have been pretty. It would also have been quite inconsequential. The marks on the floor say we should stand on these. Question is, do we trust them? Well, if you don't trust them, nothing's gonna happen. We're gonna starve to death and then turn into... Well, I guess we won't because of the firstborn... Yeah, I thought it, I thought we would starve to death and turn into firstborn's minions, but no. Uh, we remember the people from Blackwatch. They didn't eat for 65 years or so. 
So that's not an issue. I'm not detecting any curses or traps, sir. The floor mechanism appears safe. Right, so, um... Hey, I, I sent Alpha to that one. Go there. Advance to waypoint, Alpha. And Omega, stay there. Yes, sir. Okay, so here's the issue. Uh, these two need to be active and this one, so let's do it. And the bloody bridge. Let's go. Come over here. I'm right beside you. Great. Well then, now we can advance. And I guess we can play a little bit as church. We haven't really used her abilities too much. Gardens of Hell. The gardens are lavishly decorated with fountains and statues. The surroundings look impeccably beautiful, but with vicious touch of sadism. Huh. Okay, I guess we're getting even deeper into the temple, into the garden areas. Oh, this doesn't sound good. Actually, we wanted to try as church, didn't we? So, let's do that. Oh, more dead people. Good. Oh, There's you! So, I suppose, uh... Leech's men have made their way here, somehow. I, I'm not quite sure how they make it through the breaches. I mean... Were they just following us? No. Doubtful. Maybe they, uh found their own way to reopen them after we've been through. Or maybe they're even ahead of us. I mean, I guess we're kind of chasing Leech, so... It's probably be in front of us. Um, do that then. It's like the walls are talking. No, I think that's the tortured souls, actually. Ah, that's very nice. These uh, legionaries are completely Holy Mary, of God. vulnerable to being uh, attacked by the tentacles, so they can't really protect themselves. And then you can just attack them from the other side of the shield, so that's good. Oh, this is... Ugh. He's impaled. And also castrated. And I can't even kill him, unlike the people on the cross. That's awful, I wanted to help you there, but didn't work. Uh, very not nice. At least these guys are actually dead from the looks of it. So that's a good thing. I mean, you have to kind of take what you can get, you know, when being dead is Who's preferable. Well, you joined up, so don't complain, Delgado. I've been giving him way too much credit of late. He's still a jerk, by the way. Just letting you know that. It's coming this way. Okay. Look, over there. No, 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 I wanted to... Damn it. Hey, motherfucker. That was not supposed to happen. I tried to run in, activate the blood ward, but it certainly did not work at all. Fire the hole. Friendly fire. Not that friendly. Not good. Right, let's switch back to the church. Maybe there's another opportunity to make good use of the uh, blood ward. She's not doing too great, is she? I'm not even sure if uh, Rawlings can heal her when she's not actually down, you know? I think she just has to regenerate her health on her own. Oh, there's something. Yeah. Indeed. Look there. Oh. Can't do the blood ward right now. Oh, 
Oi! You're supposed to be stunned. There we go. That's better. Yeah. The limitation based on her hit points on her health is kind of bothersome because it means that I can't really use it as much as I would want to. And advancing is kind of difficult because you have to wait for your health to regenerate before you can use the ability again. But without the ability, you're kind of screwed, so... Eh. Ah! And then that happens. Well, at least he got still... St he still got stunned, so that's alright then. That's supposed to be sneaky what we're doing right now. I, I guess so. Oh, there's a dude. There's another dude. Well, I'm in no condition to use the blood ward right now. This way. Yeah, follow me. Uh, it would be nice if you followed along. Right now, let's do this. There we go. It's one less down, guy. Yeah. May the Lord's mercy descend upon you. Come off it. Right. Um I'm not seeing the garden part. I mean I see some greenery. But it's mostly still temples and all that. And ugly statues. I guess it's more green than we've seen in the entire game, though. I mean, everything else was sand and dust and blood. So, this is, this is nice, I guess. I mean, it's, it's not a stroll in the park, but it's the next, be next best thing, I would say. Uh, looks like another Delgado door, so... Let's try and solve this very hard puzzle. There we go. Can I make it? I think I applied the right solution. The network is still down, sir. Oh. Seems like a pool of some sort. Don't step in it. Come to join the feast. There's plenty for all. He's inside my head. Uh, won't you come closer? My eyes have grown so weak over time. Jesus. Is that magic I smell amongst you? Why, this isn't another batch of outsiders come to ruin our party, is it? Oh. I love your kind more than any other. The sport is almost as satisfying as the flesh. I got first dibs on the fat man. He's all yours. I'm not getting anywhere near him. And what's this? You bring witches with you too? <laughs> you honor me. It's been so long since I tasted of both sexes. Sir? Sir, the construction of this floor, sir. Let's begin, shall we? It's a trap, sir! No! Morituri te salutant. Yeah, that's Latin for those who are going to die. Hail you. I mean, I, I could say it in German much better than that. Die Todgeweihten grüßen dich. Uh, that was my on-the-fly translation from Latin into German into English, so it kind of sucked. Anyway, it's, uh, it's supposed to be a, a greeting that gladiators would give to the Emperor, knowing they are... Probably about to die. Vikis has enjoyed literally thousands of years of continuous sexual gluttonous and bloody orgies and has no intention of it ending now. 
he'll do all he can to prevent those sent to close the breach and remove his hellish appetite. Yuck. Oh. Surprised we survived that. Oh. Okay, well, I think this is a good place to stop for now. In the next episode, we'll see what this story and the whole gladiator thing might have to do with the game. Didn't we see a Colosseum on the way here? Hmm. I'll see you then, folks. Bye.